All right, well, I guess it's time to do this over again. Bam. Oh, that city wasn't the biggest. Wait, no, I'm not ratchet. Why did it get bigger? What? <laughs> Hold on here. City's not supposed to do that. At least not a German city. Alright. We'll just keep healing you. Everyone can just go around you. You can move up one. Promotion. Yeah, sure. Heal. You move over there. And I'll keep the city. Oh, God damn it. I, everything in queue is now no longer in queue. Son of a bitch. <clears throat> this is very highly disappointing. Wait, what, what city is this? Dortmund? Alright. I'll, I'll build a commercial up, I guess, like right here. Oh my god, I have to do literally everything. <laughs> oh, shit. What'd you say? I was just... I was just eating. Alright, you have no choice but to patiently wait, alright, asshole? You can't rush a man while he's eating. Hmm, well... Ooh, it was five minutes, mate. Oh, well, here's your dare. Oh, sorry. It's... Oh. Londo, Londo, come up here, Mundo. Oh! What's the notifications? White Hulk has finished, has finished loading? Well, I mean... I would, I would hope so, I mean... Oh, place was captured by Germany. <gasps> no, that bastard. He won it. Fun fact, he would. Well, certainly. Alright, let me move up and attack the city. You move there, you move there. Uh, you move... There. Okay. Should be the end of my turn. <clears throat> Soul has two maize, one dye, tobacco, two marble, and that's it. Really? What'd you unlock? Apprenticeship? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I, uh, I always go for apprenticeship because obviously industrial zones are very helpful and they add production uh, and they make shit way faster in your cities. And usually I'm under production because I usually go really wide and have like no production to work anything. So usually I end up having to get apprenticeship and then machinery. Dude, these crosswomen from fucking Seoul are helping out so much. Alright. You attack the city. You attack the city. Alright, now if you guys, you crosswomen, could like shoot the city while uh, it's your turn, guys, that'd be great. Alright, end of my turn. Uh, what is that, Chennai that's unhappy? The fuck? Why are you unhappy? Why are you the only- uh, I guess there's tobacco there, I could just get tobacco. Oh, well, you already got tobacco, and trouble, son of a bitch. Alright, what else do I need then? Mm, what do I not have? I guess I don't have elephants, I could- Ooh, niter! Didn't realize I could see that. Oh, I have two- Ooh, mm, mm. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> War's just gonna keep on going. Oh yeah, I have plenty of like niter. Oh yeah. I'll probably build a settler. Let's see, put wait no, go back down there. I need to look at this. Put a settler maybe probably on the forest as much as I don't want to. Go over by the niter. 
Wait, if I put it there, it would be out. <clears throat> so then I could buy that and then... Nah, I'd rather just get the Niter as quickly as possible. Uh... Guys across from and not shooting the fucking city. That's kind of your gig, crosswomen. The whole reason you exist for me. Oh, I see that great profit. I'm gonna take that ass. It's sad that you can't take great people, they just go to the city. So if you completely demolish someone that has a great person, you don't get it. Which I feel like you should get it. That Niter gives three food and one production, and if it, I worked it, I'd probably give like three production and three food. Why does Niter give so much food, by the way? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> it always gives me at least like three food. Yeah, like, it gives you, well, at least for me, it always gives me like three food usually, so it's weird. Okay, alright. Alright, and then you attack. Oh, damn. Hello. <laughs> Alright. Are you fu- If this guy does- Okay. Alright, please take the fucking city. Yeah. Thank you. Literally no health. I'm pretty sure he has zero health. Yeah, he has- He doesn't even have a, a slither of a health bar. That's pretty hot. How many cities do you have? Just just two or like two of yours? Oh. Okay. Alright, well hmm. <laughs> I'm just really over here like, huh man, that's okay. Right. Uh I'm about to get another one, so I'll just count that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, uh, fair enough. Cyrus only has three that I can see. Pedro probably has three as well. I'm guessing the normal is three right now because that's what it seems like, anyways. Buy this building. Nope, still, I still need to build something there. Uh, right, well, I mean, you've pretty much slaughtered their entire well being, so. <laughs> Pretty sure that's like not surprising on that part, you know. Like, just saying. Wait, can I make this city actually do production? Hmm. That is saddening. That means whenever you go and attack those barbarians, you could actually get a free settler. Two free settlers. I mean, it's free settlers. I would gladly take it. POWs. <laughs> ah, yes. Oh, this might be the Persian capital. It's like right next to Gandhi. Yeah, pretty much. That's pretty much what I do. Well, it's the fact that I can't really function properly without having a lot of cities. Well, it's the thing that, like, I don't know how to properly stay with the times with a few cities. So I need a lot to be able to build a lot because I have no production usually in my cities. Yeah, I'm very bad at staying with the, um, the age if I don't have a lot of cities. That's why I'm very bad if I don't have at least, like, five cities by, like, fucking AD. Because by then I fucking, I have trouble staying with age. I don't know how people would stay with it. Like, do you guys just focus on fucking campuses or something? Well, then I don't know, fam. How much science does a person over there with the most science have? Okay. I'm competing. <laughs> This is something I need. Alright, yeah, I figured. 
Alright, there's another Gandhian city? Jesus Christ. That's right, I didn't say Indian, I said Gandhian. You like some of that shit? Hmm? You like that? <laughs> Alright, we need to go up to another one. There's Persia. Persia can get fucked. Uh, this person needs to go up. And we'll keep the city. Prepare this. Create a Hanza. Ooh, maybe <laughs> there's a district there that'll give a plus one. Uh, oh, I get a plus four there. Never mind. All right. Yeah, and I could end up putting a district there. Yeah. Okay. I'll do that. Now that I got the Hans, I gotta think about adjacency bonuses. I'm not sure how I feel about that. Oh, what does this great engineer do? Towards Wonder Construction. Will you just sit there, buddy? I'll try to find you Wonder Build. That's probably my favorite uh, great person is the one that speed up wonder construction because if you're going for building a lot of wonders, they're perfect. And the fact that they help anyways, in case you ever do like start building a wonder, you can just hold on to them. They don't like check at all. If they come to me, they come to me. I actually don't ever like pay attention to that. Okay, let me check. The one that's closest to me is four turns, and it's a great scientist, I guess. And after that, it's a great merchant and a great prophet. Yeah, so. I'm probably going to steal that from you, and then you have to wait another fucking... Whatchamacallit? Gandhi, why are you running away with your great prophet, dude? What are you doing? <laughs> this is like your last city, isn't it? What the fuck are you planning to do? Like, see, he's just... He, he's running over to the Persian city, dude. I don't know what exactly he's going with. Okay. I still have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven swordsmen, so. I don't have the most manpower anymore, but I'm like right behind the person that's right uh, in front of me, so. It's okay. Plus, I'll be able to make the musket then. Me? I only have 175. Never mind, I shouldn't say no, not much anymore because uh, from the sounds of it, it sounds like... <laughs> Wait, is that the person that has the most manpower? Or... Wow. Wow. Second place? What? Who the fuck are they fighting? Barbarians. <laughs> oh yeah, man. Barbarians are in first always. Let's be real here. Uh, let me actually look. <clears throat> well, we'd be fucked, wouldn't we? All right. What does it look like? Who's leading a dom? Oh, I'm leading a domination. So then, that's Japan right behind me. Then. Where are you at on domination? The center. So you're that question mark. Yeah. Okay. And religious, I'm actually. I don't know how. But I'm fourth place. <laughs> and in science, I'm third place, apparently. There's someone ahead of Brazil, which I'm guessing is Japan. China's, is China even focusing on religion, or...? Yeah, I, I got 417. Yeah, I don't either. But I got 400 and fucking... Uh, 17, I'm making 13 to turn, so. I don't know how the fuck I'm making so much faith without a religion, but you know. Right. Your delegate, the bolt, learned that Brazil is training with a mix. How dare they! Oh, by the way, I found the northern map. Well, I haven't found the left side of the map, but yeah, I mean, <laughs> what asshole? You got a problem with me? Yeah, fair enough. Can't blame you.
All right, Hanza, you need walls. Doesn't well, I did mean housing, but I said walls. I was about to say, doesn't housing provide walls? But apparently not. <clears throat> That's monarchy. I guess you'll just build a settler. Why not? Well, no, it depends on your government. They don't provide housing unless you have monarchy. And then it's a uh, plus one housing for each level of wall that you have. Oh, okay. So since I took a lot of Gandhi's house, well, buildings and shit, apparently he had monuments or something in the cities. He's now making 19 culture turns somehow. Yeah, so I guess I just took like... Yeah, that's the thing. Because like, if it was something special, then I don't think I'd be able to have it. Is a thing, so I'm guessing it's monuments. Then again, you got Gandhi, he was literally oriented around culture victory, so I think that he probably would go for monuments. Yeah, Gandhi's yeah, that's his whole gig, dude. And civilization is the culture, not necessarily religion. Although, in this one, I guess he's a little bit of both. Both, yeah, he's like the only one that is both. Probably should be, honestly. Yeah. Because, like, I don't know how the fuck that would mix. Oh, man. Don't you know? I learned about that from Neil deGrasse Tyson. Yeah, I did, actually. Uh, someone demanded me a deal, huh? Ah. Oh, someone proposed me a deal. <laughs> hmm. Let me check one. Ooh, one tabacky wacky for no, no. I don't know, dude. <laughs> I know you're not talking to me. Wait, crosswoman? Well, the crosswoman does like forty something damage, I think. So, you know. Where the hell did I put the industrials in? Is that you? Are you the industrial zone? Really? Fair enough. Where the fuck is... Is that... Okay, hold on, look around. I built the Hanza already, so whatever looks like the Hanza is probably a Hanza. It's my special production district. It, it gets built in half the time, and it, uh, you get adjacency bonuses for production for literally, like, everything, pretty much. So you can put it anywhere, and most likely it'll have an adjacency bonus. It's pretty, it's pretty ripped, bro. <laughs> what? Yeah. Germany is known for that person that can literally do it all because of the production alone. Just because he has so much fucking production, he can build everything in like two fucking turns. That's the whole reason I wanted to be fucking Germany, so I could just build shit fast as fuck. Which it has worked. Yeah, because... If you have all your cities, like, you know, going wide, say, uh, fucking, obviously you have way more to do in all the rest of your cities. Like, some you'll still have problems, but most likely, you know, going wide, uh, your cities won't grow as fast, or if they do, they still have, like, you know, they're new. So you'll still always be, like, building something, most likely. My houses are running in the house of... What the fuck is this? Gandhi. What? Why is your great... <sighs> okay. <laughs> okay, Gandhi. Okay, Gandhi. Okay, Gandhi. Okay, Gandhi. Should I just kill Gandhi? He has one city left. Well, the thing... The thing is, is... No, I. he only has one city, and I went all the way up to his last city, I thought. Because I forgot he had another city, but he has one all the way back down. So I would literally have to take like 20 turns to walk all the way back down and take that city. It is. It is quite unfortunate. I think I will. I mean, I kind of have to walk there. So 
Because I don't want to leave him around because then that's just one more denouncement I'm going to have to deal with for the rest of my fucking life. And Gandhi will denounce you for the rest of your life. <laughs> and seeing as we're apparently Queen fucking uh, Elizabeth II right now, we uh, can never age. Yeah, yeah, there's like, once you're denounced, they don't stop denouncing you. <laughs> it is forever denouncements. Alright, America. America's the only one that isn't actually, like, unhappy with me. They're not necessarily happy, but they're not unhappy with me. Because they have negative 12 for me warmongering, but they also got plus 5, plus 4, and plus 3 towards me. But then they got negative 2 and negative 8 on top of negative 12. So. I don't know how that's working, but okay. I wonder if they'd go to war with Persia again, uh, with me. Very nice one. It is a nice one. Uh, Cyrus. Yes, of course you would. Gun well, not Gandhi. Uh, America. Teddy. Old Ted Ted. Old Teddles. That's all you, fam. That's all you. What the fuck? There's a warrior here that I'm having to kill? Who the fuck? The warrior is. Oh, is it Persia's guy? Nice. Yeah, I don't necessarily need gold, so when I get it, I might not do the gold one. I'll probably end up doing the science one or something, or maybe production. Are the production one still there? I would hope so, because I would love to have some production in my religion. Germany almost never goes for religion, so... It's gonna be weird seeing Germany just be like, Hmm, <laughs> eating up all your love. Oh, I can move over and then attack. Yes! Kill me, people, huh? Bones there, uh, make peace. Make, make, make peace. Okay, never mind. It's Gandhi that controls that city state then. That's interesting. There we go, they're dead. Uh, there was no tundra to the north. So, you know how I seen tundra? There is six tiles of tundra. <laughs> and that's it. Fucking great, dude. Uh, now do I settle in the desert? Or, no, I kind of want that night here. I'll settle... Mm... Oh, I don't know. What? Going tall or oh okay. Yeah. Oh, I thought they gave you units. I thought the whole gig was like, they're supposed to give you units. That's what it said. I didn't know it was to give you unique units. I mean, fuck. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, that is a lot of faith. Unless you're making like 50 faith a turn. 24 day. God damn, dude. That's nothing. But, wait, yeah, wait, what? <laughs> That's still nothing. You'd have to have like a lot of it. That what? Yeah, I mean it's a warrior, but like, well, no, no, it's not even a swordsman because the swordsman is like eleven more manpower than that. That is a spearman, but like <laughs> has one more maintenance.
DDO it is. <laughs> Do I have tailing? What'd you say? Why? Ah, oh, yes, it is time, my my young ones. <laughs> it is time. I have the better version of that. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Every time you fucking fought him, you've lost against him, except for like when you had fucking infantrymen, so. You know. I was about to say Persia's like gone, gone, but they only have like one more city, so fuck it. Horseman for three gold for 30 turns? Sure. I don't. I'm not using my horseman, so fuck it. Another deal? Oh no, this is a demand. No. No, I have him, Chief. Sorry. Fight me. I'm willing to go to war over a fucking deal. I am. Full, full force I am. But then again, that probably shouldn't be too surprising to me. I'd go to war without fucking... Without needing incentives. You're gonna love the New World Order, honestly. I have. I was all in the span of like 30 turns. <laughs> yeah, it'd be a while until I can capture more capitals. I'd have to go through one more Persian city to get to uh, Brazil, and then I could follow that down to America and Scythia. No. No, I don't have a Great Prophet yet. I still have... Let's see. I have 160 out of 240 points. I have six more turns. Did they... Did they... Did they do it? <laughs> Is there something that they really need there or something, dude? Is are they going after Mercury? Like what the fuck are they doing? Yeah. I'm about just go to war every time they fucking put a settler like close to that and then just take the settler as it's there. And then you'll just have free settlers, and you can hold one of them as long as you want to. <laughs> yeah, you like what you see, you little fucking cunt, huh? America's happy with me now for some reason. Oh, they fought a war with me, so it didn't give me... So they don't seem as a warmonger because both of us fought in that war. They'd have to consider themselves a warmonger then. So my points have just gone down for the warmonger penalty. It hasn't gone up. Well, so I guess we're friends again. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here you go, Teddy. We're good buds, right? Yeah, we're totally good buds. You're the person I'll make an alliance with soon. Oh, Ghani proposed deal. Ghani is literally one city. What, what did God? What can what can God give me <laughs> that I can't give myself? <laughs> Love. <laughs> oh, that's sad. <laughs> that is that is most certainly probably the case too. Sadly, <laughs> I will never have what Gandhi has, or you for that matter. You both can live peacefully with like no cities. I cannot. What's that supposed to mean there, Chief? Yeah. Uh, guess he can just starve, I suppose, you know? He's used to that, though, so we might have to, like, really get him to starve. Like, just put popcorn and all this other shit in front of him and just watch him fucking die. I do want to do it. 
Is it the settler? Bearing his back together. <laughs> Destroy a city three times, in fact. Hmm, perhaps this isn't a good idea. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. They didn't want to go twice as hard. I think it's because even though you're taking the settler, there isn't a city there. So every time they look for a new spot to settle, they see that and they're like, ooh, this looks good every time. They just have fucking they have amnesia. That's what it is. They just they forget what happened. <laughs> yeah. Oh, by the way, Endurin, if you could. Yeah, fucking, they just have like immense non-memory. They have memory loss like a son of a bitch. It is like the rising sun. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Dude, America only has negative 10 for warmongering. Guess how much everybody else has. Oh, wow. Yeah, so with everyone else, it's 80 to 90 for negative for warmongering. And meanwhile, America's just like, yeah, I, I don't see nothing wrong with this. Did it get taken? Please don't it got taken again. <laughs> uh, the barbarian, dude, please. Please. And? <laughs> yeah. They walk right in. The oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, that's sad, dude. That is fucking sad. Jesus. It's amazing is what it is. What's the benefits for this place? One production. Uh, wait, is there any more gold city states actually? Yeah, there's Zanzibar, but somebody owns the shit out of them. I'll do Bandor. Yeah, sure. Jesus Christ. How much science does Japan have? <laughs> what about giving you fucking heart attack, dude? 300, holy shit, that almost killed me. Jesus. 54, they have one more than me, I think. They got, yeah, I got 53. They got one more science than me. That about fucking actually killed me, dude. Like, my eyes widened like a son of a bitch. I was like, 300? The fuck? Have you seen the manpower? <laughs> Hold on here. Something quite like this. He would have probably been fucked, dude, if he had 300 manpower. He would have been able to go to the end of the fucking tech tree without a problem at all. You would have been so fucked at that point. I don't think anybody knows where Japan is. Can I go to Harbor actually here? I wanna make a scout because I don't have any scouts anymore scouting around, so I'd like to like get more of the land and see what's going on over there. I had three, I think. I think I had a warrior and two scouts. Oh, yeah, I forgot I'm at war with Persia. Oh, and Gandhi. Yeah, that's right. Alright, well. Gandhi, I'm just gonna stay at war with because he's not a problem. I can just keep him over there. He has literally no manpower, I think. Yeah, yeah, he has no manpower. Uh, Persia has 70, though, so they're a bit of a problem. Not too much of one, though. 
nothing concerning. So why can't I build a fucking swordsman? What the fuck? I need another iron, don't I? This is some bullshit I don't agree with. Uh, where is iron? One iron there, it's outside of that border. Okay, there's one here. Okay, I'll do this one. Oh, wait, I don't even have to buy a fucking builder. There's one over there just sitting there. Ah, uh, yes. I'm building three settlers right now because some places need housing, and I decided that I'm just gonna expand, I guess. I've run into it a bit because. Like, all of my lands are in, uh, like, really fertile fucking, like, green lands. So I'm, like, running... <laughs> green lands, yes. Green lands, yes. Yes, indeed, yo. Uh, but yeah, I'm running into serious problems. Please tell me. One swordsman. Hmm. Hmm. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> uh, incredible. One. Uh, I don't, uh, I, I don't understand that. <laughs> my mind, my little, my little boy brain can't handle that. Because I just can't understand why wouldn't you want to fucking get more military, but then I'm like, I, then I gotta understand the fact that not everyone is an absolute fucking maniac when it comes to getting more land, so I guess that makes sense. What the fuck's the there it is. There it is. This city can't build any fucking more and I know I should let it like do things. Nice. Yeah I get five gold from Muscat. I well probably not now. It's been a while since I looked. Yeah, mom scrap. Yeah, I uh that's why I tend to not make traders in cities that are close to enemies. I always just keep them like in a, in a, in the inner circle of all my cities, but then again you only have two cities, never mind. That makes sense. <laughs> yes, I make songs. Dude, how many... Okay, not catapults. How many crosswomen does your best cities they have? Mine has nine crosswomen, a <laughs> a chariot, and that is all the military has. That's no melee units. It is literally just a chariot and nine crosswomen. Hmm. Hmm. What? Why are you? That they don't count as military they don't go towards fucking that's just there yeah yeah okay all right i got a great prophet by the way what should i name my religion um... <laughs> i think i think i know what i'm gonna, gonna name it hold on I'm going to name it Strictly Business. Alright, it has to have one S because... <laughs> because, uh, uh, yeah, there seems to be a problem. <laughs> not enough, uh, not enough letters. So I guess it's just Strictly Business. 
All right, let's see. What are what percent? Oh, there's the production. There's the first production one. Oh, that's the only production one actually. Hmm. Yeah, I can do that. Uh, let's see. Missionaries and Apostles are thirty percent cheaper to purchase. That would be nice. Since I ain't we're making a lot of faith right now. I could spread my. See, the thing about Crusade is it could really work with my play style. Because combat units gain plus four combat strength. Well, plus four, plus ten combat strength when within the borders of foreign cities that follow this religion. So I could jo just go and spread it to like all of Brazil cities and wipe them out in a matter of fucking seconds. Combat units gain plus five combat strength when within the borders of friendly cities that follow this religion. So that's like the other one, Defender of the Faith. Uh, okay, religious spread from Jason. See, that's nice too, but I think I'm gonna do the. Ooh, I could get gold actually. Probably. What? <laughs> what? Yeah. But it's probably... Yeah, I was gonna say, it's probably yours. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Cairo. Oh, we're back. Sorry, the recording stopped for a second. I don't understand why. Uh, oh, and the frames are bad. Yay. 